All right, welcome to this week's Tea Dating Tuesday. Does it make you laugh? Does it make you laugh? You know what? It's um autumn. It's hot like fuck. I'm sweating. Anyway, it's the fifteenth of September, twenty twenty. Um, this talk, obviously, my talks are never prepared because you know I'm that way. Yeah, I don't know why I'm moving my head here and there. I don't give a fuck though. Um, but anyway, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Yeah, uh, let's talk about uh, the delusions that we have. Now, we're getting to some TI shit here. I told you, uh, I'm STPD, yeah? Uh, which is a, a personality disorder that basically, if you look at the symptoms of it, it's what a TI is. <laughs> yeah, so basically we're prone to delusions, but when you know that you play the game of life, the game of life, I invented it, it's there's... Um, Four hands, one is yours, and three of the other hands belong to, um, let's just say, uh, the components, uh, that, uh, component forces that influence your life in terms of ontologicals. Yeah, so we're talking about paranoia, we're talking about paranormal, and we're talking about conspiracies. These are three things that exist. Now, when you're delusional, you have to be careful that uh, you don't mistake uh, events uh, with respect to paranoia, paranormal, and uh, conspiracy. Because uh, what makes you delusional is when you mix it up, when you mistake the paranormal for conspiracy, when you mistake the paranoia for <laughs> for paranormal. <laughs> so so uh, basically, but then um, just thinking, sometimes I have a play in my head where I just make up like characters in my head to suit situations. Uh, and uh, when it does come true, then it, it, when it hits home, it's very, very hard to, to, to believe, you know, like um, you can think, oh, man i bet there's a man doing this there's a man um trying to to do this this and that yeah and like i just tell you just now yeah i just like i don't know what came over me but i just <laughs> opened the car and looked outside and there was a cat staring at me this is the second time it's happened it's a mammalian thing we don't go into it we're all mammals yeah the cat doesn't know why it's staring at me i don't know why it's staring at me yeah um so we just looked at each other and we just go out, go out about our business. But I noticed those things. The second time I've noticed it, I just get this urge to open the window. And I look, open the window, I look down, there's a cat staring at me like it's... Staring, I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, so you can't really say that that's conspiracy because a cat doesn't really know how to... Well, um, they are the, the, the best killers in the uh, mammalian world because obviously they go straight for the jugular. So that's the best kill move. Uh, it's a bit like a fatality in, in, in Mortal Kombat. <laughs> Finish him right for the jugular. <laughs> um, so <laughs> but in, in terms of conspiring to, to set up that situation, it couldn't have been the cat that done it. Yeah, it's something paranormal that happens. It's mammalian, some kind of resonance. I, I can't, you know, it's just too deep. Yeah, I just, just will not go into it, it's just too deep. Yeah, but it's just that, it's not what I was expecting, but when you when you say like, okay, uh, man, I can I bet there's someone doing. The, you can look at the play. You can look at the play. You can look at what's happening. Like for example, if you if you start having accidents around the house, and and then you say to yourself, okay, I bet there's someone's just sitting right outside my my house in a trance, and you open the frigging window, and there's somebody sitting there in a frigging trance. Yeah, things like that. But obviously, before you open the window to see that's happened. You have to treat that with a pinch of salt. But when it does happen, then it moves from paranoia to conspiracy. Yeah. Now, with, with the cat business, that, that is, I'll put that down where it, that's paranormal. Yeah. Sometimes we do that. Sometimes uh, you can be walking and then you just accidentally turn and you look at each other and none of you plan to do it. It just happened. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to make this laugh, but I can't see how it's funny. Yeah, it's just the way they make, I mean, it's not a big deal anymore, but it used to be a big deal for people to have mental illnesses. It was like, you know, forbidden for you to talk about it. But now it has to be out in the open because like at the onset of schizophrenia, it's very, people are very, very delicate. And I've been at it, I've been going through it for 20 years. Um, so I'm, I'm quite okay now, but there's certain people that when you hear certain stories, you're like, oh yeah, it could have ended like that. <laughs> yeah. You know, somebody's just realized, oh my god, they're seeing all my personal thoughts. They're gonna see all those secrets I have. 
they're seeing him to my thoughts and no nah, nah, i can't do this life so there's some people who are like that at the beginning but you get used to it you get well you never get used to it so we, we still get triggered yeah but um uh we have coping methods yeah so um you know uh uh, uh as an intellectual um uh, being triggered is is uh not really the worst thing that can happen to you but uh you still have to deal with it yeah so <laughs> um i think it's funny for for people to make such a big deal about confusing something whether it's conspiracy paranormal or paranoia yeah that's what i was saying yeah so you you that's life life is like a play but there's some players who are not normal <laughs> who are paranormal and there's some players who are just like how could you make up your life that my life is going to be about attacking other people and that that's what you're going to do in your life i mean how could you make up your mind to do that it's funny man that's, that's ridiculous like you know um but oh shit i've gone over six minutes now for, it's supposed to be five minutes anyway does it make you laugh i keep looking at the clock yeah i'm not i'm um, trying to ignore the thing does it make you laugh titillating tuesday